Set over there. Uncle Convoy. Wiped out. By who? All shut in the back. Probably ambushed. Burn the cart. Flaming arrows. Japanese arrows. Lord Shimura's men? Japanese archers did this. Likely a group. Unless Sensei Ishikawa has been here. <gasps> Please, excuse me, my lord. It's a bad idea to sneak up on me. I thought you were with the man who killed these Mongols. He was samurai, but older. An archer? Sensei Ishikawa. Where is he? He said... He'd come back to my house in a day or two. Why your house? I have food, a fire. Whatever his business was, it seemed urgent. It's possible he picked up Tomoe's trail. Where's your house? Not far, but there's a storm coming, and I need to check my snares first. Then I can take you there. Fine, I'll go with you. What's your name? Matsu, my lord. What exactly did Sensei Ishikawa tell you? Nothing more, my lord. He wasn't the friendliest man. Sounds about right. I never talked to a real samurai. War brings unlikely people together. It's my chance to ask a really good question. Don't mess it up. <laughs> What's it like to hold the power of life and death in your hands? It's a heavy responsibility. But you secretly enjoy it. Only a monster would enjoy it. That's not the answer I expected. There! One of my snares. Check it quickly. I don't want to miss Ishikawa. Damn. Empty. Have to reset it! You might have more luck hunting. Oh, I could never do that. So awful. Maybe try a different bait. My bait never changes. What do you use? The illusion of opportunity. There's your problem. That only works on men. 
This way, my lord. It's not easy surviving up here. It's hard everywhere. I fled north when the Mongols came. Alone? My parents died when I was a girl. Been on my own ever since. Your family must be very important. My uncle is Lord Shimura. Wait! You're the one people talk about. The ghost. But you're not ten feet tall with eyes like a demon. As far as you know, but demons often visit humans in disguise. I know there's no such thing as demons. I hope. <laughs> Besides, you're much too handsome to be a demon. And if I were a demon, I would agree with you. Look! They're stealing my catch! Drive them off, my lord! Please! Wait here. They're starving. Hey! Please don't hurt us, my lord! That's not yours. We are sorry. It's just a squirrel. We have eaten grass and tree bark for days. Take it and go. Thank you, my lord. You let them escape. We thought dinner. They were starving. And no threat. Doesn't sound like the ghost I've heard about. Not all the stories about me are true. The blizzard is almost on us. How many more traps do you have? Just one. But it's farther away. No one will believe I talked to you. What's it like to be the ghost? It's not easy, but I wouldn't change it. No doubts or regrets? Plenty, but I'll do anything to drive the invaders from our home. We should get back soon. I don't want to miss Sensei Ishikawa. The last trap is just a little farther, my lord. Here we are. Hope we don't go hungry. Look at this! Dinner! You got something? We might eat like civilized people after all. What's up there? The mainland. No Mongols, no war. Somewhere I can start over. Say you make it to the mainland. What then? In Kyoto, I'll open a fancy inn. Learn to play the shamisen. Welcome the undying parade of beautiful men and women. While my servants rob them blind. Sounds like Kyoto's in trouble. Snowing harder. We should go. Maybe your sensei will be waiting for us. The weather's getting worse. Stay close. If I get any closer, we'll have to share a horse. What was that? Never mind. Keep going. I'll deal with him. Stay back. Shoot the green samurai. Yeah! <laughs> 
No wonder they tell stories about you. Where's your house? Not far. Come on. Here we are. Let's get inside. You seem too kind to be the ghost. But the way you killed those Mongols... I do what I have to for Tsushima. The truth is, we're both survivors. We have darkness in us. If we didn't, we'd be dead. Sensei Shikawa said something similar. But it sounds more natural coming from you, Tomoe. Ishikawa always said I underestimate my opponents. I don't have an arrow in my back. Why not? The Mongols turned against me. After you trained them to slaughter our people. A mistake I tried to fix. But I can't kill all my archers. Not our own. You need me. And the sensei. But we don't need you. I know where they'll attack next. We can ambush them together. You get a victory, I get revenge. I'll talk it over with Sensei Shikawa. Jing. You can stay the night. No, Tomoe. I can't. I work metals, woods, and cloth. An excellent choice. Goodbye. I look forward to hearing of your work. I work on all kinds of armor. Sakai! Sakai! You have news? Something like that. I spoke with Tomoe. She's hiding in the north. The Mongols turned against her. If you saw her, why is she still alive? Her archers are preparing a massive attack. She wants the three of us to wipe them out. Or she needs both our heads to get back in the Mongols' favor. She could have killed me, Sensei, but she didn't. Hmm. I have never been rewarded for trusting Tomoe. I don't trust her. But we need what she knows. And I believe she needs our help. Then she's a fool. And we finish this. Thank you. 